Welcome back. Madison Magazine's Barbecue Festival, one week from tomorrow. We have a preview for you today. Joining us was Rachel Tatchke from Madison Magazine and Bob Rumley from Bob's Barbecue Emporium. Exactly. Thanks for being with us. In case folks don't know, Rachel, tell us about the festival. Sure. Well, it's the best darn festival to kick off summer. It is May 19th and 20th in Sauk City. So it's a 20-minute drive from Madison. It is free, and you get to try so much amazing barbecue great live music madison county friday night saturday is a full lineup all day and night including wheelhouse and the love monkeys um, amazing beer craft beer but then also favorites free kids area and it's just a really fun time free event and it's going to be beautiful and so you want to grab some barbecue and and drink some beer bob had to come out here bob wow. yeah <laughs> taste test and this this is a, a contest <laughs> So um, this year, what we're going to do is people can vote for their favorite barbecue out of the vendors who are there. And we have some amazing different restaurants there. So we have local favorites like Bob's Barbecue Emporium. Um, Dan Fox is going to be there. But then we also have some national vendors coming in also um, from Philadelphia and Chicago to also sell their food. And then people can vote for their favorite. So, Bob, what makes a good barbecue? Low and slow. That's the way to do it. That's the way we do it down south. Is it beef or pork or both? This is beef brisket. This is Texas style beef brisket. The salt, pepper, red pepper flakes, 12 hours and smoke. 12 hours? Yeah, pretty you, much. You gotta plan ahead. Yes, you do. <laughs> I was up slaving all night just to make this for you. The pork belly takes uh, not quite as long. So when people have a preference? Well, you know, I win awards for the brisket and I win awards for the pork belly. This dish right here actually won first place at the first Madison uh, Magazine Barbecue Festival. What is it? It is bourbon maple syrup, oh, syrup. and pork belly rubbed with uh, salt and sugar and maple syrup from my own maple trees. Wow. <laughs> That's something. Yeah, Talk that about eating local. <laughs> right? I mean, a lot of people, I think, when they think barbecue, they think down south. Maybe Texas. Yeah. Is Wisconsin becoming more famous for this? You know what? You can get good barbecue anywhere. Uh, just, you know, it doesn't have to be down south. I happen to be from down south, and so I brought, you know, some of those cuisines up here with me. Uh, we'll have a Cajun dish uh, that we'll be serving next weekend, as well as Texas-style brisket, and uh, the pork belly, and some chicken. And oh. ribs. Can't oh. forget the ribs. Oh. <laughs> a lot of different kinds. That's right. So it's something for everybody, the whole family. Yeah, definitely. Bob's going to be actually demonstrating how to do pork belly from our demo area at the, at the festival. So there's going to be lots of demos on Saturday, too, so people can really figure out, hey, how do I smoke my own meat or grill my meat on a you know big green egg and all those kinds of great things. So, yeah. And, and free. It is free. Are there full meals? Can you get a whole meal? Oh my gosh, yes. So there's going to be like a dozen vendors there who are going to be selling all different types of delicious barbecue. And you can get your standards, you can get your ribs, your pork, but you can also get, you know, mac and cheese barbecue and nachos with barbecue top. So, and there's delicious, I mean, cheese curds, Culver's ice cream is going to be there. It's, it's a great all time. Right. It's this week, next weekend. Next weekend. It's Friday and Saturday. That's right. All right. And what's the park? Um, it's in Sauk City, there right off Highway 12, Meyer Oak Grove Park. So. Easy, easy to get to from, from Madison. All right, go and pork out or beef out, <laughs> whatever. <That's right>. <laughs> <laughs> Bob?